Hey everybody, it's Safi and Marco Dish Hat on Movies, the only movie review show on YouTube to review movies in terms of food. And it's just Marco here once again. I am I am here to review season 25, episode 1 of South Park Pajama Day. Now, first off, obviously, this is the you know, we're back to normal seasons, but we will still have movies. Uh, this year and and uh, like a couple from now on. I can't remember how many we're going to have. I think it said like 10? I, I can't remember. Uh, but it said like two are coming out this year. So I'm looking forward to that. If they're anything like uh, the the post-COVID specials. Because those two, those two movies were probably some of the best stuff South Park has ever done. And uh, the character development was really good. And I think that, first off, well, I already said first, I guess secondly, this episode was a little rough. It was rough because, just because we just got back from the return of post-COVID, which was an A-plus episode, or I guess A-plus movie. And, we, you know, just getting back from that, this episode was a little rough. That being said, it is still a pretty good episode. Like, I wouldn't say it's a great episode. I wouldn't say it's a bad episode or even an okay episode. I just think it's a, a good episode, <laughs> if that makes any sense. You know, if I, because if I, I don't want to be too negative about it. Uh, it, it, had some, it definitely had some funny jokes that, you know, they were pretty clever. You know, I really love the... I loved all the Matt, the Matt Damon jokes, because that commercial is hilarious. And if anything, you know, you guys should go check that out because it's, it, it's just it's pathetic, you know, these celebrities. But you know, they want to make money, so they do these little stupid ass commercials. And uh, I love the stuff with Mr. Garrison, uh, and him telling all of his boyfriend problems to the class, and he's got the. It, getting them in trouble and you know that's just classic Mr. Garrison uh, and I love seeing all the different characters in their pajama outfits you know we got to see like basically every character in their pajamas and it was even nice seeing Randy for a split second on Tegrity Farms uh, on his tractor with pajamas I would say that the episode it got funnier as it went on. It was definitely funnier in the second half. Uh, but still, it was just kind of like, eh, it was good. I give this episode a B. I will say, though, that it was a way better premiere. If we're talking premiere episodes, for some reason they count the two specials from last year as, as season 24, quote-unquote. Or whatever they count specials in a season, I, I, that doesn't make any sense. Uh, but the the last premiere I think was Mexican Joker, and oh, this is way better than Mexican Joker. That's for sure. Uh, I give this a B, and I think that it's a strong B. It might get lower over time, uh, but I think that it was it was an overall pretty funny episode. You know, once again. Cartman steals the show, you know, Cartman has, he used to be the, the mean, evil, joke character, and now he's sort of become, he's, ba him and Butters have basically become the, the heart of the show, at, or at least like, to, to where all the fans, they love those characters the most, you know, especially after these uh, COVID sp uh, movies, whatever, uh, you know, no one really, I don't know, do, do we really like Stan anymore after what, what he was like in those specials, like the way that he, he changed and then he never really had any character arc and, you know, Kenny's kind of useless and, you know, I think that like Cartman and Butters, they're, they're the standout characters and so I, I can't wait to see like if, if the other characters get some sort of uh, redemption this season. And I, I'm not saying I don't like them anymore. I'm just saying, like, 
you know, Cartman is clearly the best character on the show. And it's crazy to, to think that since the the whole series, he's always been looked at as the the evil, mean character, even though he's funny. Uh, but now it's like, you know, he's really the funniest. Uh, he's had the best storylines. You know, he had that great one where he had a girlfriend and everything and, and the thing with him and the COVID specials. And so I really, uh, if, if we're going to do... Instead of doing Tegrity Farms seasons, you should just do Cartman seasons, honestly. <laughs> because I could watch a whole season just focused around Cartman. And then it was nice seeing his mom again. So yeah, I would say it was a good episode. Uh, not a great one. Uh, still, I liked it. Uh, please like this video and then comment and tell me what you thought of the episode. And then uh, please let me know if, if you're... If you think Stan or Kyle are better than Cartman, <laughs> or even Wendy. I mean, I couldn't imagine. If someone said they like Wendy more than Cartman, I would probably jump out the window in surprise. I would just be like, what the fuck? And just fucking burst out the window in shock. And then please subscribe to our channel if you'd like to see more South Park reviews. Okay, goodbye.